Out goes it, almost Maxwell, and this is what, what did we not see? This is the segment where I, Zach Hanner, take you on a deep sea exploration of all the rare creatures that reside in the abyss. I'm sorry, what? What did we not see, spelled S-E-A, where I take you- No, no, I know, I caught all of that. What are you doing here? I requested airtime at the station and they gave me carte blanche to take over whatever segment I chose. And you chose mine? Well, I wasn't gonna choose Cape Fear History and Mysteries. Have you seen it? It's amazing. They tell North Carolina stories and folklore through reenactments. I can't get enough of it on WWAY News and full episodes on WWAYTV3.com. Today, I bring you three unique sightings found in the abyss. All right, shoot, I'll take a week off. Do your thing. Australian researchers have captured footage of the rarely seen headless chicken monster. This was off the coast of Antarctica. The headless chicken monster is a type of sea cucumber. It's only been on video once before, and that was in the Gulf of Mexico. All right, cool, so it's only been seen once before? It's only been on video once before. I've seen it with my own eyes. There I was, on a research vessel off the coast of Veracruz, when suddenly, there was a banging on the hull. The ship rocked with each thud. The sailors rushed to the edge to see the source of the never-ending volley. Something told me not to look, that the sight would change me. But curiosity got the better of me. I peered over the edge in horror. One of the sailors screamed what it was, but I already knew. Monstruo de pollo sin cabeza! It puffed up to gargantuan proportions and struck our ship asunder. I alone floated to shore on a piece of driftwood been hunting that beast ever since. Know this, if it takes me a thousand lifetimes, I will find it and I will kill it. Wow. Okay, uh, I don't believe a word of that story. And that will be your folly. You said you had some other discoveries that you wanted to uh, share? Oh yes. And we now go to the coast of California where the pariah refreshens jellyfish was spotted. This predator jelly has a bell three and a half inches in diameter and around 30 tentacles. Its red color allows it to camouflage in the sea because red light is not visible in the abyss. Oh, that's, that's really fascinating. All right, so what's a But do not let the pariah refreshens distract you from its main intent. The jelly has an intent? Yes to make us forget about the headless chicken monster. Beware the headless chicken monster. It's invertebrate, but it has enough backbone to follow through on its mission to end us all. Yeah, okay, sure. Um, so what's our final discovery in the abyss? No, 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 it's, it's in the abyss. We stay off the coast of California where the EV Nautilus has found a cluster of over 1,000 octopuses brooding together. <coughs> Octopi. <coughs> no. These female octopuses tuck themselves between rocks and use their tentacles to protect the eggs. Not only is this the largest cluster of octopuses ever spotted, it is also the first time this species has been seen near California. Ah, that's an incredible sight. It's very beautiful, but it also fills me with fear. If we don't know about a cluster of octopuses this large, imagine how many headless chicken monsters are breeding together, lying in wait, shoring up their numbers until there's enough of them that the age of man comes to an end. How much sleep are you on? Oh, I've been awake for 20 years. That'll do it. I'm Zach Hanner, and this has been What Did We Not See? <laughs>